Scotty says, on the topic, how do you find graphical content like images for your projects? Do you pay artists or draw them for you? I heard that using images on, from Google, Google can get you sued. Yeah, you don't want to use images from Google because Google just uses other people's images. Did you hear about what's going to happen to Google and Facebook because of Australia and maybe Canada? Basically, Google, Facebook um, have been making a lot of money pointing and consuming other people's content, like um, specifically news sites. It's been reciprocal to a certain ex it's been reciprocal to a certain extent, but um, so anyway, long story short, Australia and it looks like Canada may fall. They may charge Facebook uh, for every time. <sighs> Google, they might charge um, uh, Facebook for uh, linking to news sites. I don't know, so because all the newspapers have been folding. Because if you look at Facebook. And Google, their real business is just classified ads, right? They took all the classified ad business from newspapers around the world. That's what they did. And they pointed to their concept, their, their, these, news, uh, these newspapers' content. The uh, so problem is somebody has to pay the reporters to gather the content, right? Um, what else? So, yeah, so don't use images from Google. Um what I do is when I use images like the lizard wizard image, I, I just got it from, um, I licensed it, right? I licensed it from a, um, I think it's iStock. I went to iStock for that one. So if I go to lizard wizard here, see that lizard right here? This guy right here, that is a licensed image. I pay for it. it it's not worth the head headache. So if you're doing commercial work for a client, you should license and pay for that photo. It's not worth the risk. Um, there are um, Wiki Commons, I think it is. There are websites that do have images that are basically open source. Uh, but check those licenses and be very sure about that because it's not worth having that risk, uh, especially if you're getting paid for it. And, you know, and just tell the client, say, listen, you can get these free images that look like, mm, or we can take photos. It's going to cost you. You got to charge for that. Or we can buy stock photography and buy the license, which is the cheapest by far, most of the time.